Okay, here's part 10 of the playthrough. This is what we've been building towards the climax of the game. The New Republic and the remaining Imperial Remnants, or most of them anyway, have begun fighting at Jakku. This is a hugely important event in the Star Wars canon, marking the official end of the Empire. The Battle of Jakku can be seen in lots of other Star Wars material, such as the Aftermath trilogy, the Alphabet Squadron trilogy, the book Lost Stars, and lots more. The mission itself contains numerous references to those stories and the smaller events that happened in them. Inferno Squad specifically joins the fight as it is already underway, and they focus on helping people fighting on the surface of the planet. Destroying that factory had a bigger impact than we thought. Admiral Akbar is calling all Republic ships to Jakku. The whole Imperial fleet is there, minus the equipment they would have received from Sullust. I expect my father will be there too. But catching him is no longer our priority. This battle could be the end of the war. Let's get in, and we do what we can to help. Goals. Too many to count. Del, the Corvus is yours. Cover the sky. Sherv and I will help on the ground. Hold on a moment. Aiden. Make sure you come back. Make sure I have a ship to come back to. Hey, Shriv. I hope you survive this incredibly dangerous mission as well. Thank you, Del. Your friendship means everything to me. As you can see, it's absolutely chaotic. The fighting on Jakku went on for weeks, even after the Empire officially surrendered to the New Republic. All the Imperials that were stationed at Jakku either fled and became warlords, stayed to fight and eventually died or surrendered, or were invited by Gallius Rax to rendezvous in the Unknown Regions, where they would eventually form the First Order. Del, we're approaching a distress beacon. Patch me in. Yes, ma'am. This is Captain Lindsay! Our ship has crashed! The Imperial walkers are cutting through the survivors! We need evac, now! Heads up! Enemy ships closing in on us! TIE fighters, inbound! Let's take them down. TIE destroyed. This is Commander Iden Versio, Inferno Squad. Help is on the way, Captain. Shriv, patch me into the fleet. 
This is Inferno Squad calling Starhawk Command, requesting an orbital strike. This is Starhawk Command. Inferno, you are go for orbital. Paint your target and we'll rain fire. Orbital Barrage, here! Scan. is done for. Time, Captain. Good luck out there. Triv, back to our ships. Can we talk about that orbital strike thing for a minute? Sure, what about it? That, I think that was the best thing I've ever seen. You almost sound like you're enjoying yourself. I would never. focus on what's down here. Phantom Squadron, inbound on the Empire's ground defenses. Wedge, Snap, take out those cannons and keep us clear in the stars. We're working on getting the Ravager out of this fight. Oh, what happens if we cross paths with your dad? 
We've spent so long trying to track him down. I really don't know what happens if we find him now. We should focus. He's not the mission. New orders from Admiral Akbar. We need to secure access to an Imperial facility in Carbon Ridge. Can I get any assistance on the ground? Not bad! Bombers! Here we go! Nice! Please confirm that destroyer is on a deliberate crash course with the surface. Confirm! We have operatives on that vessel. Send a recovery team to its target vector. Affirmative, Command. Who are we looking for? Idel and Kyrell. Tenants behind enemy lines. Affirmative. We'll find your boys. Nice shot, Bercio. Okay, that's that. Commander, that downed Star Destroyer is deploying bomber reinforcements to an Imperial research facility at Carbon Ridge. That facility is a key target for the Republic. Fight! We can cut off those bombers from inside the hangar. Great idea. Find somewhere to land. My idea, but how are we gonna shut down that hangar? We get inside and search the records for remote detonators. They don't know we're here. Good. Stay close. Wait until I open fire. Our bombers are keeping the Republic at bay for now. Gather any equipment you can. We need to be ready when the evacuation. Arrives. Scan ahead. They're coming from that hangar. First, we need enough detonators. Then that's where we're going. To the hangar. We just need those detonators. Scan for me. Detonators here. That's not gonna be enough. Keep an eye out for more. More detonators. More explosions. Time to shut down the hangar for good. Oh, great! TIE Fighter on top! Find heavy weapons! Now! Sniper! On the field! Scan, please. Straight onto the ties. An explosion that size will chain all the way through the ion engine systems. And shatter the ship from the inside out. Exactly. Detonator planted. Detonate. 
Detonators are primed. Okie doke. Let's get out of here. Fast. Commander, we have a problem. What was that? Your father. He's found us. The Admiral is sending bombers after the Corvus. They'll have to get through us first. Let's take them down. Yes, Commander. Got him. 
almost over. Not yet. Get the Corvus to safety. I'm finishing what we started. I'm gonna get my dad. Aiden, he's not worth it. I have to try, Del. Now go. Fine. Retreat! Close one. Aiden. Aiden? I'm okay, Del. I'm gonna find a way inside. You and Trip follow the next distress signal. Aiden, no way! We're coming back for you right now! No, you're not! That's an order! Droid, disable comms. Aiden, no! Slice this. Scanning ahead. father off this ship before it goes down.
You don't have to go down with it. This is a rescue attempt. I politely decline. We have to go now. Rax expects me to leave, too. This is where I belong. I gave my life to this empire. Fought to keep it strong. Hard to believe this is all that's left. You saw the Empire's weakness and refused to let it consume you. It made you stronger. That's why you're leaving here without me. You deserve better than this. No, I don't, but you do, Aiden. You deserve to live in peace. Go. Survive. Live. Tells me you're alive. Looks that way. I'm glad. Now, come on. You gotta see this. That will conclude the main story of Battlefront 2. There are a few other missions after this one, but they are a part of a separate story mode that takes place decades later, around the same time as The Force Awakens. Anyway, it's been fun to replay the campaign mode again. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching.